Welcome. I show you how I create graphs using the Fibonacci add-on. I made this single car grass objects and it is important that the origin is at the bottom as you can see and it's important that we select all the objects and press control A and apply rotation and scale so apply rotation scale for the objects and then I select it and press M and move it to a new collection I call the collection grass and now I hide the grass collection and I select an empty collection and make sure it's visible and I press shift A and add an empty. I add a single arrow and now um, I move the arrow to the left and now I press create FIBO and I press reset to default and I have these uh, these pointers I, uh, as a structure but I want the grass objects of course so um, I scroll down and in source collection name I enter grass it's the name of the collection created and now I scrub and before I press before I press update it's important I select use real duplicates so check it and press update and now instead the instead of the pointer we have the grass objects so the pointer is just the dummy okay and now we can change the object count to 100 oops 160 and I can I press update and I have 160 objects and I can sp change the spreading uh, but first I rotate the objects I sh rotate the objects with the set sequential value so make them point out outwards Uh, now I set the scale to now I set the spread factor make it closer and there's our kind of grass objects and if I want I can make the inner leaves bigger so for example like so and it gives me a different result but uh, now I want to create usual grass so I leave it at at 1.5 1 and maybe on the outside a bit, little bigger too and now what I can do is I can rotate the objects so where is the rotation setting? S X slope and I make the then point to the outside and uh, now it still looks a bit artificial so I add some random values X randomized X rotation and Y rotation and Z rotation and there's our uh, very natural grass object and if I like it I just select it, uh, make sure nothing else is selected, just these these objects and press shift D X. I scroll down and press unlink apply and I have these separate grass object. Now I can go back to the original and um, make a second version. For example, change the spreading um, increase increase the random random setting and make some some leaves bigger add some random scale maybe and I'll have a sec second second grass object and again press I select it press shift D move it and press unlink apply and I can make a third version even so this time I make the inner size bigger and select it shift D move it press unlink apply and we can delete this cone object it's not required it's a duplicate and now these grass uh, calm do not have texture so you can make it look better if you apply some texture. I'm not doing that now. But let's see how it looks in shading mode. So there are our nice grass objects. Okay, hope you like it. Go buy the plugin.
the add-on Fibonacci it helps me and you can do many things with it as you can see goodbye